Greetings, entities and guardians. My name is Hyperheims, and welcome back to Kicker Run Kingdom. So, we're gonna go back to the plumbing uh, shining thing and what's it? That's right, it's the Summer Soda Rock Vesta. Don't tell me why I named it like that. But I actually realized we're actually very close to finishing this event, mainly because the rest of the stars that I'm thinking of, they're the ones in dark mode, which makes a lot more sense. So, considering that there's a hundred and, uh, like 114 i'm doing quick math in my head that means there would be 57 that means there's literally two more levels in regards to fighting for us to complete and i'm pretty sure we can actually do that within this video because i think there's only one path for us left and that's i think if we go to this route and we go through the stolen stage and we have to do the uh, go to the summer soda stage and this probably unlocks the last things in regard to rockstar cookie because there's only one song left and we have to watch rockstar cookies last show so I'm pretty sure this is going to be the actual like, grand finale of the event, but I might do a video focusing on uh, dark mode, which, fun fact, remember when I did a video on the uh, Legend of the Red Dragon dark mode? You all never saw it because I accidentally deleted the video. <laughs> I will always take pride in that moment. Luckily, it wasn't anything lore important, it was just dark mode or whatever, but whatever. Anyway. If you do want to leave your comments and questions down in the comment section below, feel free to do so. It can be a random question, a random comment, a random fact, something about me, something about the game, something entirely different. It doesn't even matter because as long as we're having a fun time at the end of the day and we appreciate being around each other from community to creator and creator to community, that's what usually matters the most. Which, speaking of which, I will be reading comments for the video Shining Glitter Cookie Saves the Show, Summer Soda Rock Festa, which is an, it's another video in regards to the Summer Soda Rock Festa. You should probably go ahead and view that. But... We will read a couple quick comments here, which I guess we'll just read the three straight from uh, Ian Alsobrooks because they're kind of short, so may as well get rid of them. Uh, one says, I think Milky Way Cookie should be a musician even if it's just once. Uh, I could probably see Milky Way playing the good whistle. Or maybe a flute. She'd probably be a good flute player. Another comment says, who cares if you get claimed? I care because this is my livelihood. And even, I don't even just care for the money. I'm just scared that like a claim could instantly lead to like a strike, which could lead to my channel being in jeopardy. And I, the last thing I want is for this channel to like be in jeopardy. Like, I know I still have your local plug, but I haven't posted that in over a month because I'm still working on a video. But anyway, it's whatever. But anyway, the last comment you left is Rockers High is where it's at. Mm, it is where it's at. Hopefully we can get that song unlocked later on. But now we have to go back to the Soul and Stage and go ahead and go over here. And we have to just, we could just skip all of this because we'll have the other option to uh, go through. Oh, whoa, my eyes. It's the ugly. <laughs> Should have known. You probably shove a whole pizza in that mall. But anyway, now we already helped Shining Glitter Cookies. And now we got to be like, no, I won't let those bandits steal my summer soda. <laughs> I like how I'm saying it like it's some sort of a dream. Like, I won't let them steal my summer soda. I'll get the, I'll just get on the stage and take it back. All right, sure. You want to go like that? Well, guess what? We're going to go like that by instantly jumping into to the Summer Soda stage, which we have more than enough quotes to do this. I hope we do. Let's get this going. Back to this ugly-looking stage. Gross. Now that the stage is ours, get ready to witness Rock Spirit beyond your comprehension. <laughs> I'm ready to, like, pick up your tail and swing you into a bomb to make you go fly 50 million miles away. Everyone! Climb onto the stage now. Huh? Huh? On the stage? Is that allowed? T let's do something. Will you just let them take our festival away from us? No! Climb! Climb! On the stage! I'm gonna be honest. If we start rhyming like this, this would be a great show. He <laughs> calls him Stinky Boy. <laughs> Honestly, I hope that car's on our side, outside. Like, the, the car you hear outside, you probably hear him pro probably past the music. Man, I suck at speaking today, but I hope they're on side. Just, they're, on, they're on our side, just crashing into the stage. This is what I call a riot. Who cares about taxes? Yeah! Huh? Wait, who? You said you want to protect the festival? The, uh, uh, rock, rock, rockstar cookie? Oh my gosh, that face. That's like... I hate to see our beloved summer soda in the stinky hands of the durian ears. How to make someone love you. Step A. Uh, do that face. We can't protect the festival like this. Let me borrow that spotlight for just one moment. 
<laughs> you know, you just had to prep the voice, you know, before you did that loud yell, just like, Oh, it is time. Oh, shoot. There's a song here. Rock Duel of the Century. Well, it's not a song, but... Oh, wait. What is this? Uh, check Rock Duel of the Century. Oh, it's just another cutscene. But Oh, we finally get a showdown. I'm pretty sure, by the way, this is supposed to be the last story. Only just because after we did the story with Black Lemonade Cookie, she said that she would be late to the Rockstar Cookie show. But apparently before that show was the Shining Glitter one. So this should be actually the last one happening. So I guess in order, it would be Black Lemonade, then Shining Glitter, and Rockstar Cookie. I just did it all out of order. So great for me. Anyway, uh, here's some comments from Game Wisdom Gaming. One says, uh, then, uh, They way this thumbnail is put together makes it look like Shining Glitter Cookie slaps the heck out of us. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. You know, I, you know, now that I look at it, kinda. <laughs> but I made it look like, you know, they were in love, you know? They loved the Shining Glitter. Another comment you left is, It's just so stupid that they completely redesigned Shining Glitter Cookie just to realize her original design as costume two weeks later. You guys are beyond me. Listen, I'm pretty sure... The reason why they did that is just, you know, a little reference to Oven Break Lovers, and they just wanted a new, fresh style for Kingdom, especially in regards to Rock instead of Pop. I'm pretty sure they just did that as a little, you know, a shout to Oven Break players. That's just my opinion. But your last comment says, My favorite song is Rockstar Kiki's Rockers High. The twist where it actually is the loading screen song that we've been hearing all the time is cute. I also love the song. It goes hard. I actually did hear the song Rockers High, and I didn't. Uh, I heard that it was like the main menu music for the update. I was like, oh... Well, that's pretty interesting. We just don't get to hear the full thing of it in the main menu. It's just a little bit of a snippet. Anyway, let's go ahead and talk to this pleb lord. I.e., you know, the pineapple bootleg crocodile pleb. <laughs> so you wish to face me fair and square, huh? Oh, they're gonna cheat. That is not the way of a true rock star. Yes, it is. Looks like you and I, we have some very different ideas of what the rock spirit is. But hey, if you're willing to prove me wrong, <laughs> you're most welcome to try in a rock duel. So easy. <laughs> you got the nerve, I'll give you that. But you don't know who you're dealing with. You're going to regret sending those angry fans back to their seats. Why do you just want him to just keep on riding on stage? Because we can keep doing that. I hear the maracas. <laughs> so you got the nerve to request a duel. Let's see who you are. Have you got the fuel? Oh boy, here we go. Yeah! Hear this sound it goes. Shaka shaka, you better fear me, cause I'm Raka Raka. Overlord of the Maracas, I'm gonna win the fight. You know who I am, Shaka Raka! That's right. I've been saying his name I've been saying his like how do I say this? I've been calling him Shakaraka, but I spelled it R-A-C-K-A. It's C-K-A, you know. I thought it was R-A-C-K-A, so I thought it was spelled, you know, Shakaraka. But no, it's Raka. Oh, I've got some editing to do on some videos, because I've been spelling his name the wrong the entire... Did the game just... The game... <laughs> I should not have pointed that out, because now the game actually crashed. Alright, so good news, let me put the cutscene again, which I'm very grateful for that. Apparently, it won't let you continue unless you get through the entirety of the cutscene, which makes sense, and luckily I didn't even have to spend any quills, so... Let's get back to this. We no. We want more. Uh, only from Rockstar. That was quite impressive. Hope Rockstar Kiki knows what he's doing. <laughs> Not bad, if I do say so myself. You know, I love me a decent challenge. Oh, no, for a change. He's done this before, and he's swept the floor. Now, it's my turn. Oh, and now it's going to be Rockstar Cookie's turn. This, this is not going to go well for Shakaraka. Stinky Frenzy? What does that mean? Let's go through some comments first, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to read a comment question of the day. I know I did crash, but just in case, you can never be too sure. Uh, Latte4094, I don't think I've seen you in the comments before. You said hello, which hello to you. I know it doesn't look like I'm waving my hand, but in real life, I am waving my hand. Devonch Malik left a comment saying, Common question of the day, glittering dreams. Good song, I'll admit. Uh, you know, that common question of the day asked, like, what's your favorite song in this game mode? Uh, Exotic4890 left a comment saying, no, this story has three endings, aka three routes, so it's not forcing you to. 
Uh, I guess you are right. Technically, it's four because that's parfait too, but eh, it's different. Whatever. Anyway, Princess Blue also left a comment saying, when are you going to finish the Legend of the Red Dragon story? Technically, I did. I mean, if you're wondering when am I going to focus on the hard mode, I don't know, maybe in my off time, like, maybe I could stream that. It just doesn't seem something that I can mainly prioritize on because there's a lot of other things that I can do. But, I don't know, it's just dark mode stuff. That's all I have to focus on. Because, I'm. Have you? did you not know I finished it? Yeah, I did finish it. I beat the last part, and then I also beat, uh, it was like the, uh, it was the epilogue story where you can face the dragon multiple times. I think that concept is stupid, but whatever. Anyway, for a common question of the day... I guess I yeah I obviously have to ask one. It's not like I can, and I can go one day without like asking a common question because it's been it's basically been a part of the format recently. But I guess if you wanted to play any sort of guitar like instrument, what would you play? And I know that's kind of weird, but there are different types of guitar instruments that you can play. Like you know, there's the classic you know electric guitar or just like a solid you know classic wood guitar. I actually have one of those. I used to have an older one, but it was more plastic and small. But then Zach gave me this giant big one, which. Uh, you know, it's one of my friends, fun fact. It's not spoiling anything, who cares? But anyway, you know, it's a bigger one. I want to use it more, but I just don't know how to play it. I would like to get take lessons. But there's also, you know, a banjo, a plumbing ukulele. There's multiple types of guitars. And honestly, I would like to try and learn, you know, something like an electric guitar. Because, come on, electric guitars. They look and sound cool. Like, legitimately, they look and sound awesome. I would love one of those. In fact, I'm pretty sure my lover uh, would love one of those as well. I'm not even sure if they own one, but if they did, I would like to them to have one. Anyway, Rockstar Cookie's turn. Let's go ahead and do this. Let's see the real rocker in action. And of course, the stage changed just for them. You see that crystal right there? <laughs> Those are the crystals that I stole from me. Anyway, whoa, Rockstar Cookie. Rockstar Cookie, you're the best. Is this the song that they're singing? Am I supposed to wait? No, it's, it's just them. Why didn't they get the voice actor for this? I don't know. This is kind of weird. Just no voice. I'm not going to voice. He has a full-fledged voice actor. Like, I can't do justice to what he does. Me by your side can rock out. This is our jammy. Our jam. This is. No, this is our jammy hell. Ooh, this is. I already like the lyrics. It has hell. That's the mean word. <laughs> the rebellion starts. Oh, did the, the music just change? <laughs> A thunder rumbled so so hard it made the game freeze. Huh? Oh no, it's starting to rain. <laughs> I know your cookies turn into soggy crumbs in the rain. Have we learned nothing from Parfait Cookie's story? Just keep going. What you gonna do, Rockstar Cookie? Can you keep rocking on? to pour down I'm getting wet my dough I'm turning soggy I thought it was milk that milked the cookies not water like you can see ginger brave swimming in cookie run over break and he's completely fine now this you just can't handle a couple water drops get a plumbing umbrella oh no rocks are cookies losing his jam uh, we're on everyone we're on we're on we're on everyone sing along I gotta do it the cheers the waves it starts with me uh there's two endings here I guess there's, uh, uh, we're on, we're on, we're on. Everyone sing, let's, let's sing along. Woo, we're on. Do the wave and sing along. We're on. We're on, we're on, we're on. Huh? Y you can't just lift me up like that. Uh, I'm crowd surfing towards the stage. Oh, there we go. I'm not sure if there would have been a difference, because I feel... Wait a second. Oh, I gotta try- you know, I have to try this. Gonna go ahead and skip through all this, and then the rain's gonna come, but then there's the other dialogue choice. Uh, I gotta do it. The cheers, the wave, it starts with me. Whoa, we're on. Do the- There- <laughs> There's no difference! It's the same exact thing! It's just Rocker's High all over again. What are you kidding me? There's no difference. What's the point of choosing? 
I guess maybe there's some independent choice for it. I don't know. A gamer left like five comments, and, the, and since they're rather long, I kind of have to speed run through them. Anyway, all the comments say, Personally, I did the story in order. Perfect Black Lemonade, Shining Glitter, and Rockstar. Well, good for you. I didn't even have any idea for that. Uh, your other comment says, uh, Speaking of video game pop stars, the one surprised me was Nation from the Kirby series. She was a diva from the Forgotten Land, and the song, the main theme, Welcome to the New World, was canonically sung by her and sung in the Forgotten Land language, New World script, and the representation we have of her during the Kirby 30 Anniversary Music Festival. Well, honestly, proud of her and proud of her for just her singing voice because. You know, Welcome to the New Land is a very good song. I also have some ads that are for a travel agency, a random mobile game ads, and an ad for a mobile game that is literally Pokemon Let's Go footage for their ad They're trying to get the mythical and fabled Nintendo Ninja to attack them. I hope they do, and I hope they get sued. As someone who played Osu, the background animation doesn't bother me. I tried to get used, I tried to get the highest score on all the music. The only thing that ruined my combo was when I got hit or I missed a note. That happened a lot in Transfigure. Well, hopefully you can get that full combo perfect thing. Because I haven't, I think I've only gotten like a perfect combo in like only two songs, but that's because I played them so much. And the last comment you left is, Comic Quest of the Day, you, you know the, the one thing I should, excuse me for a second, gets off the video after listening to all the songs. Well, that was wonderful, they're all good. <laughs> I kind of love Parfait and Shining Glitter songs, but that's all. The steamed ham ref was intended. Oh, that's a steamed ham ref, well, good for you. At least you took the time to look all the songs up. <laughs> anyway, back to the main rockers at hand. No, very, very possible. Got the true one rock you ever just, you ever just rock so hard you don't sog up anymore? I am defeated. Once the legend of the Pineapple Isle. I know. No, this cannot be. Hey, look, Pleb Lord, there you are. I refuse to admit it. Didn't, didn't you get like eaten by a giant squid monster? I thought that happened to you. I prepared this stage for the legendary Shaka Raka. And you sad butch, you ruined it! I don't know about you, you're looking more sad if anything. Get that flatster! Hey, that's a term that we do not use around here. Who are you calling a flatster, you stinky? <laughs> oh, it's stinky frenzy time, here we go. Alright. Oh, this is the, f the, the true final boss. Cat, uh, plumbing Stink Eye Tortuga back at it again with the Mace Swing, Cat Durian Passive, cause entry to attack. What the pleb? Uh, Shell of Thorns, Whirlwind, and Projectile Raid. I don't think this is going to be easy. Because considering if us trying to fight Shack uh, Shakaraka, sorry, I used to call it Shakaraka, but apparently it's called Shakaraka now. But apparently, since we did that, uh, I apparently got his name wrong the whole time, but I'm pretty sure there's only like one wave and it's gonna be the boss. Okay, let's get through them. I should have probably done my buffs first, to be honest. Uh, get our shield set up. That would be probably the most important. Uh, probably should have had Tartatan's rocket shoot also. Did you get bigger the last time since I saw you? I feel like you did. Let's get our buffs up again and just spam everything. That's a big target right there. Oh, that's a- Oh. That's a, that's a rather large missile, but guess what? We are protected in the zone. You're not gonna do nothing to us. I'm gonna do this. We're gonna hit you with a giant fire. And we are doing- we're doing pretty decent damage. Let's get our HP back up to full. What is that? Show spin attack! Come on, big missile, big missile! Okay, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Just a little bit more. We're fine. We got our shields up. Don't do it! Oh! We lived. We got him. Just before that other missile- do you just fly up into the air? What the club happened to you? You were just like, you know. Well, guess we plumbing did it. We took care of that plumbing boss. Before we continue on, by the way, we may as well, we may as well just get through this whole story in this video because may as well. Mona left like th uh, four comments, so I may as well just go through them. One comment says, five reasons why uh, I, I, L L Y L V 2 carrot is the best. She's she's five stars. She's cute because I can. She defeated stage 1230 with my lowest cookie, uh, Snapdragon. Uh, wait, with Snapdragon, Lilac, Dark Account, Almond, and I love level two carrot cookie. Good for you for loving that level 12 carrot cookie. Uh, I am bored, so here it is. I can sing my ABC to you. You will see because I give you this A because you're awesome, B because you're beautiful, C because you're dominant, and the D because you deserve it. <laughs> you just give me alphabet versus Mona. What is your what is your life? <laughs> Another comment you left is I got lime cookie super epic costume and crying right now for happiness. That is a good costume, very good costume, I'll admit. And your last comment says comment question none why because they're all perfect. Oh, that's sweet. Appearing cookies new entry found. Well, there we go. We have rockstar cookies rockers high. This story is all done, because now we just have to do this, and it should give us a song. Let's go ahead and watch it. Yeah, this should be the whole entire ending, and then we can just read the rest of the comments, then we can play the last level. Then we'll basically be done in the whole gnome mode. I made sure I did unpause it. Okay, I'm good. 
Get up, Shaka Raka. We don't have much time. What? The festival's <laughs> grand finale! The last song! Care to help me out with that? <laughs> this song... <sighs> like lemonade cookie. <laughs> Used to keep it on repeat till dawn. Those were the days. Black lemonade cookie. What I said back there in the artist zone, I didn't mean. I have no idea what you're talking about. You look good on stage, though. Love the song, too. <laughs> you too. Aww. Actually, all made up in the end. Well, it's for two rock stars. I'm assuming that's Rockstar Cookie and a Shaka Raka. Won't stop. I don't want to stop. The dawn is still far away. Our sweet dream is here, candy, jelly, sugar, dash, so don't stop until we're on Rocker's High. Won't stop, I don't want to stop, the dawn is still far away. Our sweet dream is here, candy, jelly, sugar, dash, we've come so far, finally. We're on Rocker's High. And this is where the song plays. Yep, and that's us, little coconutian Plub Lord, and this is the main menu music. We are officially done with the whole entire story. All we have to do now is just sit through this song, and then play through the song during the actual rhythm game mode, and then we're finished. So I guess I'll just focus on the last comments for now. And then I guess I'll give a general input on like what I thought about the story. So first of all, Shining, or I'm sorry, <laughs> Sonic Gamer left a comment saying, when it was revealed that Jenny, uh, Jenny Yokobori voiced Black Lemonade Cookie, I decided to look up what other characters she voiced. Here's something that surprised me. She voiced Kur Kuromi and Cinnamon Roll in Hello Kitty and Friends Super Cute Adventure. That's quite a vocal range if I do say so myself. <laughs> yeah, that's quite a big vocal range. And that's very impressive. Super Pog Sonic says, please pin me. Fine, I'll pin you. Since you asked, at least. Smart and Spiral left a comment saying, OMG, finally, Shining Glitter Cookies on stage. And at 11.50, I don't have any favorite songs, but I already finished listening to the songs. It's so good, but the vocals are Korean, by the way. Eh, it's whatever. Oh! Is this in Korean? Yeah, this is a different language. Maybe it was always meant to be like that? But I thought it would be English, kind of like uh, the rest of them. Because the rest of the songs weren't English, right? Eh, whatever, at least they're giving us English subtitles. But, lastly, there's one more comment from Lenata Geo saying, My favorite song in the update is Transfigured by Black Lemonade Kiki. Sounds so good and cool. Yeah, I gotta admit, that song goes... <laughs> that song is very good. And honestly, all the songs have, like... They're all very good, and they all have, like, their personal charm to them. So, I just gotta appreciate all of them at the end. But anyway, I gotta be honest, for a story... I actually genuinely enjoyed it, especially I really liked how it gave some backstory to Shining Glitter Cookie, I like how it introduced Black Lemonade, and also gave more, a, like, a more of an in-depth look at the style and attitude of Rockstar Cookie, because they just seemed like a lot more chill cookie just vibing with all the rock music. Literally, I think all the cookies that they introduced in this update, despite kind of being hard to get them all, because, you know, two epics, uh, Rockstar especially taking me so many crystals, and Shining Glitter I don't even have yet, maybe I can get them in another video, but it's gonna take a little bit of time, because, you know, that stupid system of trying to get shiny glitter, but other than that, story was pretty decent. I didn't have as many problems with the quotes, but I'm pretty sure that was mainly because the story was a lot more feel good in comparison to the Legend of the Red Dragon, because there was a lot of fighting and a lot of side loot that you could collect. But with this story, there was only like I don't know two or three side missions that you could do to get some extra loot, and that's not even much. But I think it makes it more enjoyable that way, because now I I managed to finish this with an absurd amount of quills. But I know there's probably going to be some more things that I can find out in the dark mode, but that's going to take a lot of playing through. And, of course, I can do that anytime I want. It's just one of those things where, like, if I play through now, I can get extra rewards out of it. But, sorry if I've been talking over the song. I still think the song is very good. Just from what I've been listening from the actual pitch of the song myself and some of the lyrics that I'm hearing. Playing an amazing song. All the songs were amazing. Like, hmm. I don't know what I could choose if I had to pick a favorite. I'd say Transfigure is definitely high up there. It's hard to even put all these songs on tier list. <laughs> it froze. It's been rocking too hard. Uh, I hope it doesn't crash, because that means I will probably have to sit through this and the whole entire thing again. I guess it will give me more time to talk about the actual event. Eh, whatever, it's back on. Uh, but, yeah, I definitely think this story, especially if they're planning to add more cookie stories, definitely a bigger improvement than the uh, Legend of the Red Dragon, because there was just a lot more stressful fighting in that. And, obviously, the boss fights, they were difficult. But, like, they weren't super difficult to the point where, like, you needed a... Man, he hit that high note incredibly. But, like, I, they weren't too difficult to the point where, like, I need to just instantly start upgrading and just, you know, start panic upgrading and stuff. It was just one of those things where, like, you know, it looked wearisome, but at the end, we made it through the light at the end of the tunnel. And that's it. Now, of course, I'd end the video here, and we got the Rockstar Cookie ending reached. All is done. The only thing that we need to do now... Oh, following round's been activated. 
Great. Who cares? Uh, there we go. That's done. The only last thing that we need to do now is complete the final level, which was Rocker, Rocker's High. Let's go ahead and do that. All the comments have been fully, uh, like, rid. Like, they, they've been red. That's what I'm trying to say. So let's go ahead and do this. We're doing this at the 1.5 speed, by the way. So, worst case scenario, the game actually freezes right here. Because I've experienced a few freezes so far. Which, I, I think I need to refresh or something. But... I also one crash, which, by the way, on this new version of LD Player that I've been using, it has never crashed, at least on video before. So that's actually kind of a shock to me. But let's just try and maintain our focus. Hopefully, oh, really? Oh, oh, we're fine. We're fine. Oh, I'm so scared. It has never done that before. I swear, I think I need to give a, the computer a quick restart because this is actually kind of problematic if it keeps going up like this. Third time it fr froze, but you know what? My theory is that it's like it's so much rock going on that like it just cannot handle the intense intensity of the rock music. That's my prediction. But after this song, I'm just gonna end the video because this PC definitely probably needs a restart. And also, I'm pretty sure the Cookie Run Oven Break update comes out this same day, so I need to record for that. It's the new like Cookie Run Law update, you know, plumbing uh, face the trial. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. I missed the one jelly. I probably could have gotten this perfect if I didn't. Uh, but whatever. I'll probably just perfect it in my off camera. And of course, I gotta do a video uh, focusing on all hard mode songs, too. Okay, there's the ah, there's the summer soda. Summer has been activated. Now, come on. Ooh! What a cheeky little cut the game just did right there. Come on. Let's get to the stage. Three, two, one. It activates now. Oh, I'm scared. Oh, here we go. Okay. Ooh! Okay. I see your eyes. They're kind of beautiful. Ooh, I missed that. Oh, I missed the combo. I suck. Oh, literally just that. That threw off my groove so bad. Okay, let's try and not throw. At least how I just did right there. Oh, that was... Oh, I'm doing terrible now. It's probably because I'm in, in trying to uh, predict the freeze in the game. And I'm probably just messing up so much. So the song is just ending here. Kind of sad how it just kind of abrupts there. I'm sad we don't get a full version of the song. Unless if hard mode is different. Well, whatever. I missed a lot. I'm surprised how I still got 10 million and an S-Rank on that. Well, there we go. We're done with the song, and we're done with the story. We're gonna come back for hard mode, aka dark mode, definitely. It really doesn't matter. It, dark mode basically is a hard mode. Who cares? But we're done. All the levels have been fully completed, and I can end the video here. So, if you enjoyed this whole entire series, the whole entire storyline, then be sure to leave a like on the videos, and also share it with your friends if you enjoy my quick run content. And if you enjoy my content in general, why not subscribe? And also hit the bell icon to be notified of whatever I do in the future. I also have merch if you want to check it out, but I'm not forcing you to buy anything at all. I also have a Discord down in the description if you want to check it out. It's called the Hype News Hub. It's a fun time down there, and we're trying to expand each and every single day. And lastly, there's another link which leads to a Twitter post down in the description, where if it gets 10,000 likes, I can get the quick run YouTube set for absolutely free. But above all else, I will see you entities and guardians in the next video. Hail the hype knees.